Matt Jam Lamont. And this is Grant Nelson. And we're about to go head to head for Fact TV. Uh So what is your um, your best festival? Hey, that's you can read my mind. Yeah, I'm, your best festival experience. That? I'm believing, man. Did Bloody I not tell? <laughs> you can tell we're old school, can't you? Nineties <laughs> babies, as they say. Do you know what? I'm not a massive festival goer, to no? be honest. No. Nah. I mean, obviously we play at them. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. I don't of course. Go to that many. No, nor would I. Glastonbury changed oh. my that changed my whole shit. Bro, honestly, I had no idea it was going to be what it was going to be. Yeah. Everyone says it's magical and it's this and it's that and I just thought, yeah, yeah, of course it is. I heard the same. Bro, it really is. It is, isn't it? It blew my mind. Who did you play for when you were there? Uh, Block 9. Block 9. It was amazing. Oh, Actually, amazing. I played the year after you. Yeah, you did. You I did. did. You did. Block yeah. 9 is one of the best. Um, two years ago. You played three years ago then. Three years ago, yeah. yeah. So I yeah, played yeah. two years ago and I played this year, but you know, I played Silver Hairs. Silver Haze this year, right. which is absolutely fantastic, by the way. <laughs> Block, but your first experience, Block 9, and you didn't know what to expect. No. I knew you were going to ask me this. Before you've even asked it, I can. you're going to ask me what new people I'm into. Oh, mate, who was that good? Jesus, um, <laughs> you know what? There's, there is a guy that I think is amazing at the moment, but I don't know if I'm saying his name right. Is it Taiki Moolite? T -A Let's say yes. Let's say yes. I think he's yes. Taiki. I think he's a Japanese guy. Okay, where is he from? I think, well, from Japan, I'm guessing. But I, I, I think he's based here. I, I, I don't really know a lot about him, but I just know that his music's bad. What, what, what kind of stuff? It's is kind it? of more bassline y. Oh, like, really? It's very UK garage influence, but house tempo. Um, like the stuff like, like Il Phil does as well. Oh, Il Phil and Chris Lorenzo oh. are smashing it, but they're not exactly new talent. But Stole my thunder there, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> Cause and effects. I like Cause and Effect and Predator, right, from Boy Better Know Camp. Yeah. Because I feel Predator. Predator's can do, rugged, man. He just, oh, yeah. He can do grime one minute, and then yeah. all of a sudden Switch he's doing up. this yeah. smooth bass line stuff, and he's doing this lovely two steps. Predator and Cause and Effect. But it's great because they're all, like what we said before, they're all like UK influence. Yeah. But they're taking, yeah, but they're taking, yeah, they're taking chunks from the UK and. But, I, I, but they're making it their own sound. Yeah, exactly. But that's what we did back yeah. then. You can always tell a Grant Nielsen track. You can always, always tell, tell a Tough, tough Jam track. track. Yeah, exactly, you can always tell <laughs> MJ track. <laughs> yeah. Wookie Booker. Yeah. Uh, Sticky. Oh, every, everyone exactly. had their sound, man. Exactly. If we haven't and mentioned think, you, you can always tell your track too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, the good thing about Grant Nielsen is that his influence, I have to say, me and Carl did look up to you in the 90s. We still do. Not did, oh, right. we did, did, did. Right? caught the and did, yeah. We're all, you know, we saw a couple of your, couple of your you know, little stabs and things oh, like that. Ah, bruv, I teeth nappy so, your things as well. So, <laughs> did you? Yeah, yeah I, I, bruv, I, everyone was teeth and everything. I oh, mean, my <laughs> publisher's here, we'll have a chat with you. <laughs> but um, it was great because when you were doing all the skippy stuff and everything, it was your own thing. And so you influenced us quite a bit as well. I'm not just saying that you're sick. No. But it's true. But I think the bad thing about Grant <coughs> Nelson is that we both live in the same region, in a sense, and Grant's never been to visit. Right, that's it, right. I, you know what? He lives in Cornwall. I've been there for a year and almost six months. I was, I was going to say the same bad Cornwall. thing about Matt as well. And it's not really aimed at you per se, but it's just, just generally, really, this it's a bad, it's a bad Go reflection. On, just bring it out, son. I'm ready. It's a bad reflection myself. Is that we we don't talk enough. But it's, it's my it's my fault. Do you know why it's, that is? And it's every time I see you, it makes me think, why the fuck don't I fucking see him more, man? Bro, the good part is you haven't you've not changed one fucking iota since the day I met you. You have no airs and graces. Even though everything you've achieved, everything you've done, you're just a real. You are, what you see is what you get. This is who the, the guy is. is right? He's not. He's not like lying, man. With you with you. But bruv, honestly. No. But you know how it is. You know, especially in this scene, you know how it can be or how it, how it could, yeah, how it of course, was. Of course. Maybe not some. Well, I was. I was the same person before I got into this. Yeah. Well, I was a bit of a devil, but I changed. <laughs> <laughs> I was the same person. So yeah, just because we have got what we got, don't change it. So no, it don't change it. Anyway. But it changes so many people, and you yeah, see, you see, no. especially with a lot of the young guys now, you see them coming through. And you just, the attitude, as soon as they have something that does all right, and you just look back and think, wow, bro, you know, it, all right, it's, it's a short, sharp yeah. climb to the top. It's a yeah. fucking long way back down, though.